Alex is up next, and he wants to know who your greatest mentors and teachers in the business were. Uh, Ted DiBiase, senior, was my first real mentor that was a top guy that took the time to correct the stuff that I was doing wrong and probably the few things that I was doing right. And that was when I was in Louisiana. I very first started in the business. I I was maybe, maybe a month and a half in when I went to Louisiana. And uh, those days for a top guy to go out and watch the opening match because the opening match in those days was an opening match. It was your underneath guys that were there just to stay in the ring for 15 minutes and have a wrestling match. No punching, no kicking, no fighting on the floor. You had to work holds and stuff. And that was Bill Watts' rule. So uh, Teddy would actually come to the curtain and he, you know, he actually let me, you know, travel with him after that, you know, and a few times. And man, when you're in uh, starting in the business and you're sitting there and he would make me drive. He didn't have to work hard to, to make me drive. He had a freaking black Trans Am, Smokey and the Bandit. Love it. When you're riding down the road driving Ted DiBiase around in a damn Trans Am, I was in high cotton, brother. Mm. Didn't fun. suck. I'll tell you what, man. That's a fun fact. That's one that, to me, that's one of my dream cars. That 77 Pontiac Trans Am, like no uh, Burt Reynolds had, man. Love that car. Hell yes. Uh, Alex has more questions. He says, uh, what wrestlers uh, did you grow up watching and loving? Dick Slater, Bob Orton are the ones that pushed me over the edge because they were so good together. Gary Hart was their uh, manager. They just had an incredible thing. That was when I really first started to look at the business different. That... Well, wait a minute now. The good guys are okay. They're they're dominating part of the match, but man, those the bad guys are the ones creating all the excitement. And it just had me look at the business differently. Um, really, a lot of lot of respect for both of those guys. Uh, that would probably be the two main ones that you know. I just love the wrestling show. I liked all parts of it. Um, <clears throat> but those two are the ones that, that really grabbed me. 